All right, in this video, we're going to work here on the welcome page of the site. And the uh, first thing I need to do is delete all of this random mumbo jumbo that I have down here. Uh, that was from the previous lessons that I showed you guys. Deleting all this stuff, dragging it in the trash, just getting rid of it. Still got a line here, getting rid of that as well. We are starting fresh. All right. So what we're going to have on the home page, uh, if we again remember, go back to our MindMeister. Purpose is to grab attention and have someone click further. And after this, we want someone to go look at the photos. So uh, what I'm actually going to do is pull the first paragraph of her about page and use that here on the home page. And it's going to say Elizabeth Cairns, fine art photographer. We're going to make that large. And then below that, oop, we're going to paste that in there, but I forgot to do it with the, um, the paste is plain text. So I'm going to remove the formatting on that. And now you see the indents and all that weirdness went away. And we're going to have a little call to action down here, a button for view, oh, view Elizabeth's photography. And that link is going to go to the content and to the photos page. And we're going to line this guy left as well. Uh, so we're going to save that. We've basically done our, our basic home page. Uh, but one thing, I'm actually going to swap out this photo right here. I'm going to keep the same photo, um, but it is not compressed, this version, and that would slow down load times. When you don't have compressed photos, your load times get really slow. So I'm going to remove that and go down to her compressed photos. And we're going to upload a compressed version of the photo. Notice how much quicker it uploads. And there we go. We now have a new compressed version. And we're going to take the focus point just down a little bit. So that way we're focusing here on the actual still life portion of the site. We're going to hit save. And there we go. We have just swapped out the photo and created the basic home page on Elizabeth's site. So now the basic home page, the photos, the about, and the contact. Um, so this may all not be final. Um, honestly, with Squarespace, you kind of go back and forth because obviously this doesn't look how I want it to look right now. Um, and so the next thing we're going to do is go into the style editor, start making it look good. And when we do that, we may end up coming back here and editing the content and tweaking the layout to make it fit with the new styles.